how to upload Canva design to Printify. Hello guys and welcome to this new tutorial. Today I'm going to show you how you can upload a Canva design to your Printify POD t-shirts or any accessory. It is very easy, very simple. All you have to do is to follow up the tutorial from the beginning till the end and you will be good to go. The first thing that you need to do is to go ahead to canva.com, sign into your account. Within that, you are going to go to printify.com also and sign in for your account. From there, you are going to select and choose the uh, dashboard that you have there. And then you are going to select the sales channels that we are going to connect or in other language, a store. Click on manage my store or add a new store. You click on add a new store and here you can see the different platforms that you can go ahead and connect. We have Squarespace, eBay, TikTok, Shopify, and more. In my case, I am going to use Shopify. Let's go ahead and let Shopify, and then we are going back to Canva. From there, we are going to set up the design. Let's go ahead and create a design, even, or you can go ahead and set a uh, for example, a keyword and type in that keyword and search for the certain templates, for example, design, or let's say that we're going to put here clothing designs and see what it will give us. And from there, it will give us a bunch of templates that we can go ahead and customize and also use them for our own sake. Let's go and add something or you can go ahead and make it. I like this emoji, so I will click on it. This is a free template. Go ahead and click on customize this template. From there, you can get some ideas about the font and also about the, as you can see here, the stickers. Let's go ahead and delete all of those and simply we are going to make something uh, which is uh, very own for us. Let's say that we are going to add some text. Uh, from the text, you can add either a normal text or a font combination. Go ahead and use whatever you want from these font combination like that. Go ahead and delete that. I don't need this. And from there, let's go and add something. I'm going to put here summer like that put it at the top make sure that it is, it is in the middle I'm going to make it like this put it to the middle like that and here we have it either you can go ahead and adjust and make some effects or simply go ahead and put it curved this is the curve you can go ahead and reverse the curve or let it like that i'm going to put something like this and from here we are going to add some elements I am going to add maybe some, let's say sun, a sun, go ahead and type enter and you can see some graphics. Make sure to add some graphics like that. Go ahead and set the color of the sun as the color of the logo and also the outline right there. Go ahead and set it like that. This is a matchy or a matching color. Let's go and add something else, which is another font or text. Go right there, choose a font combination like that. Let's say that we are going to add this one. This one like that. Simply, I'm going to uh, delete the parts that I don't need and replace it. I'm going to choose this one and type vibes maybe vibes like that and for the color you are going to put the same color as the first one so we are going to unify these i'm going to put some effects for this and it which is the curve go ahead and inverse or reverse the curve to match the uh, the design like that put it like this and it is perfect now let's go ahead and add something else i want to add some wavy shapes i'm going to put waves and 
here we have it shoes the graphics let's see if we can go ahead and put some graphics I'm going to put something like that maybe like this one and I'm going to put it behind the Sun so click composition to the back and from there we are going to duplicate it and also put it here right there and for this one also click on position and to the back we have this set I'm going to delete the partial parts right there with a shape go ahead and select that shape make it white like that make it right there and here we have it now duplicate it make the same thing for the next one and here we have the things set I'm going to put for example a surfer like that or a surfboard surfer like this choose the most simplest one I'm going to put something for free and uh, let's say that we're going to add this one add this one I'm going to zoom in a little bit so this is a detail I'm going to add it right there can I go ahead and make this like that maybe this is maybe something cool and for these I think that is enough and for my case let's see if there's something that I can add or something better I think that is okay now everything set and we have the logo I'm going to group everything right there and make everything go and match each other go ahead and put this and put that put the summer and everything is grouped go ahead right there make this one like that and also group it with the others go ahead and group everything and now we can go ahead and move them around so let's go ahead and make them at the middle make sure that everything is in the middle go back right there since the elements are gone so we are going to add these white blocks or these white shapes cover it like that make the same thing from here are going to cover something like that when you want to get this as a PNG click on uh, share download and make sure to download it as a PNG click on download again and here we have the logo now the second thing that we need to do is to go to Google Google and we are going to uh, seek or search for a background remover I'm going to type here remove dot bg or bg like that go ahead and open that website simply we are going to upload our file get your file right there and in just a click and few seconds it will go ahead and make the file uh, background free click on download I'm going to download it as a as you can see here a uh, HD file go ahead and select your account a little disclaimer guys everything created in this video such as email addresses phone numbers are created with the, for the sake of the video they are not used for any personal uses so make sure to use your own accounts now we are going to set these we have zero credits so that it doesn't matter I will I will stick with the low quality one now for the printify go ahead to the catalog right there and simply go ahead and select men's t-shirt for example and for this one we have a lot of choices I'm going to use this one this is the shirt that I am going to use maybe this one this is some mockups start designing click on it and here we have the multiple variations from this particular product it will open up the editor right there here we have the editor here we have the front and the back side I'm going to put the design on the front side to import it simply click on upload my device 
and then we have the removed background logo go ahead and upload it and as you can see it is a little bit um so skinny or a little bit small for the quality and we have some stretches on the design that is because we have downloaded the design within the low quality from the remove bg you can set the quality better with some other background removers or you can go ahead and stick with this one you can add and select the variants right there here we have the ash, the silver, the athletic uh, heather. Go ahead and select whatever you want from uh, these colors or variants. The brown is not good. The maroon also. Cardinal, no. Heather, mauve, yes, maybe. Select these. And from that, you have to select also the sizes. When you finish everything, click on save product. And here we have the Canva design uploaded to our Printify. Now we have the mockup. Choose whatever you want from these mockups. You can set this, this, or that. I'm going to set this maybe. Click on publish and it will be publishing in a few seconds. Here it will be published in our Shopify store. So it will be publishing and also uploading the images and the mockups directly to our store and that was all for today's video thank you guys for watching i hope that you have enjoyed the content and see you soon on the next one